Hi guys, my name is Ashish and welcome to Vision MBA. I strongly recommend you to subscribe to our channel, go on Facebook, Instagram, please follow us and here are the numbers you can see there on the screen. Please send a text and we will be joining you to our group where we'll be discussing every information and detail about management entrance exams. Now guys, this presentation or you can say this video is especially for students who are going to appear in CAT examination again. Yes, you heard me right, again. Now, what are the reasons you have to appear in CAT examination again? Now, let's be honest to ourselves. There are two reasons. The first is you were not focused enough as the first time. I started preparing for CAT examination, but I had no clue and I was not sincere about my studies. So that is the first reason. And there is no denying to that fact. And if you are denying it, you know what's the fact. The second reason is, again, wrong guidance, false promises. A place promised that within one month or within 10 days or 20 days, I will be getting a classic score. 15 din mein I am jai or ek hafte mein JB jai. I know you will be given these kind of promises. Now, I tell you what is the fact, actual fact behind this. This is a vicious cycle. You enroll into that coaching class, assuming, hoping that yes, you're going to get admission after studying for just one week. You take the admission and we all know what happens. But then next year also, you go to them again because you feel that I've already taken admission into that coaching class. So let me go there again. I'll be getting a discount. And these people will also promise you if you come to us again, we'll be giving you a discounted price because you are our ex-students. Guys, this is the trick. They first promise that you please come enroll so that we'll be planning and we'll be training you so that you get a good score in just one week or 10 days. And once you trust that, again, you go to them. They create their customer base. It's all business. So. The first thing is you are supposed to be focused, understand what the examination is. And of course, now you do that. I'm not going to waste your time in telling you that how many questions are there. What is the approach? What is the marking scheme? You already know that. So let's not waste our time on that. Now the point is how to approach the examination. Keep things simple. Make sure that you read, you solve few questions and you practice as many mocks. The right guidance, the relevant coaching is important, not bullshit stuff that is doing the rounds. Please stay focused and understand what happened. You guys are smart enough. You guys got the right to elect a government. So of course you can take the right decision in thinking about what I mentioned. Focus on the concepts and the basics. Do not fall for irrelevant stuff. Thank you, guys.